Hello my dears and welcome back to my carpet. <laughs> so in today's video what I want to talk to you about is five amplifiers that are recommended for a kalimba. I did a lot of research in the past couple of days and I wanted to know for those of us who have kalimbas that can plug into amps what amps are the best for them. Um, and while doing this research, I got a lot of mixed stuff. There really isn't anything out there that says, hey, this is for kalimba and this is going to work good for you. A lot of these amps are universal for guitar and things like that. Um, they work for kalimba, but they're not specifically made for kalimba. So it's kind of, you know, you're just using what's already out there. Um, there is a couple that are specifically for kalimba, and we'll get into that as we go into the video. Now, before we start, um, throughout this week, I have been getting a lot of friend requests on Facebook on my personal page for myself, and I just want to say that I sadly cannot accept them. And the reason why is because more people are starting to flood into the channel, which is wonderful. That's great. I'm so happy. But when more people start coming in, it becomes not safe and I want to make sure that I'm safe and my family's safe. So please don't get offended. I would love to chat with you. You can message me on my Autumn the Columbus Facebook page. You can message me on Instagram and you can message me in the comments here and I will get back to you as soon as I can. I don't want anyone to be offended. It's not that I don't want to be your friend. It's just some of my family members wouldn't like their personal information shared. So getting that out of the way, let's begin. Oh, also too, I just wanted to show you before we get into this, how far this channel has come. So this is my Samsung Chromebook that we started filming our videos on. And as you can see, this whole bottom piece is blown out. This piece broke off. I don't know what's going on with that. And this is where the channel began. I would film on my old cell phone onto this screen of what I was working on. And it's just so crazy that <laughs> that's where we started from. And this was a $4 Chromebook that I bought at Goodwill years ago. And it still works and I refuse to throw it away because I know I can get some more years out of it. I've had it for about a year and a half now. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to get right into our first amp that I researched that said it would work with Kalimba. And I'm also going to put where these were recommended so you don't think I'm just spewing random stuff. I've got some sources um, that helped Bring them down. So we are going to start from the most expensive amp to the cheapest amp. So the first amp that we are going to start out with is Roland Cube 60 Watt. And these are quite expensive. They run up to $300 to $400. And this was recommended from the Kalimba Magic website, and I've got a link down below to where I found uh, the person's article of them recommending it and saying that they loved the sound of the Kalimba. And you can look these up and check out the individual stats on them, like you know what they come with and the sound quality. I'm going to show you a picture of what they look like, give you a general idea, and the price point. The second amplifier that we are going to talk about is the Aroma 15 Watt Portable Amplifier. This one runs for $126. And I found this on a Kalimba website called gokalimba.com and it said in the description that it was could be used on a Kalimba. I'm not sure how you know safe this website is because I have not heard about it in the Kalimba Facebook groups 
However, that doesn't mean that it's not a good website. I just haven't heard of it before. So if you have used this website before, please let us know in the comments down below and if you have used this AMP. I will try to see if I can find a YouTube clip of somebody using this AMP and I will try to post it down below so you can get an idea of the sound quality. Our third Kalimba recommended AMP is the MicroCube. This one was also recommended by Kalimba Magic, but it was recommended on their YouTube channel, not their website. And I have a video clip down below of someone using it with their Kalimba from the Kalimba Magic website. So if you would like to see that to get an idea, it's going to be down below. And they run for $160 about. You may find them less or more, but that's the about. Number four will be the Honeytone Amp. This amp runs from $20 to $30 at the most. They're relatively affordable and they also look very nice. I love the design. It's supposed to look like an old car from like the 50s type of era and they seem to have a pretty nice sound. I have a video linked in the description of someone playing it with a guitar and the sound seems pretty nice. There's also some dials on it. So even though it is relatively small, it seems to have all the functions of a larger amp. And if you are interested, I actually have purchased this amp and I will be doing a review on it. So click the bell icon, make sure that you're getting notifications for my video because you will not want to miss that video. Hopefully it will do very well with Kalimba and I think it will because of just how small it is and I don't really want a very loud sound um, because I think the Kalimba should sound light. So I'm hoping it will work. And our final amp is the JoYo 02 amplifier. And this one runs from 16 to $17. Now I am looking out for you and I just wanna say that they sell this amp on Amazon and they are trying to sell it for $55. So do not go on Amazon to get this one because you are really overpaying. Um, I also have a video down below of someone using it, but again, they're using it on a guitar. So it's not a kalimba, but in the listing I found this on, I found it on eBay. They actually had it hooked up to a kalimba. So I think it should work just fine. And I think I have seen other people using it in the Kalimba Facebook page. So if you have used this amp and it does work great for you, let me know because I would be interested in purchasing that one too sometime in the future. So just let me know. I really hope that this video was helpful. I tried to do my very best of researching stuff and trying to find the best information to give to you. So hopefully, uh, one of these amps work for you and I wouldn't stress so much on the price. I know everybody is always so focused on I have to have the best Kalimba, I have to have the best amplifier, I have to have the best everything. And honestly, you don't. We're just here to create music, we're here to have fun. And as you progress, you know, through playing and you want to upgrade, there's nothing wrong with that. But don't stress out if, you know, with hard times going on right now, you can't afford it. That's totally okay. So I hope you have a lovely day. Bye.